What's your view on the way that the whole healthcare IT landscape um, is developing and how do you see the collaborations with external providers of software solutions? Yeah, I think how, how our customers choose to share their data is definitely something that they have a lot of optionality around. And there are a lot of groups that just from a pure data sharing participate in many different uh, different data sharing arrangements. Some of them are profitable. Some of them are for care. Some of them are to build predictive models. So I think the, the autonomy lies with the community that they can choose to do that. Um, this particular iteration of it, Cosmos, has those, you know, those access restrictions that we talked about. That said, from an innovation standpoint, um, you might be familiar with uh, some of the integrations we have with the vendor community. So there's there's hundreds of applications that have connected and built on top of the Epic ecosystem. There's you know billions of API calls that happen back and forth between Epic with you know the different things that um, you know innovators have built an app or they've built a content that can be run natively within Epic or jump out to you know another window or things like that. So it's definitely something that we endorse and encouraged to be standards-based. Uh, so whether that be uh, FHIR or you know, US, USCDI export of information, these are all things that I think we've always been at the forefront of, of making sure that uh, those APIs and things are available so that you can build apps. Um, it is hard. Uh, you know, I think that's the thing is, it is hard to uh, develop within healthcare. It is a complex system that has a lot of things that you need to learn and, and be able to, you know, embed yourself within uh, departments. So like at Epic, one of the most important things that our R&D team is required to do every year is go on immersions where you follow around doctors like Dave and you get to feel their pain. You get to see if the thing you made doesn't work. And, and, and I think that's a really humbling experience that I would encourage our entire industry to spend time every year and go follow people around and feel the pain. Um, and, and I think, you know, we'll all be building better products uh, when we do those types of things.